Hi folks, how are you all doing today? I'm back with a brand new video again and I hope you should be liking this video because we have discussed this in the last session itself and yeah, I just have created that for you guys. <laughs> okay, so um, like I'll be letting you know about that before that uh, I would definitely um, tell you all guys that if you've not been watching my series right please do go back to my channel folks hub open the playlist app lab or games or programming concepts or we have patterns right so open my playlist uh, do check out all these videos which are very much interesting and, and I've been really enjoying uh, while creating these videos for you guys uh, yes, uh, it's been a month. It's been more than a month now I have started my channel and uh, yeah, it's it's really feeling very good. Uh, I, I feel very proud of what whatever I've been doing. And yeah, I should thank you all guys for your support so far and please do continue all of it. Okay, today uh, I definitely uh, like you should feel this that uh, I definitely keep up my promise right and yeah i'm back with um, the promise which i have made uh, in the last session yes so i shall be showing you uh, showing that to you so like like i told you we have this uh, artist lab right today i'm going to create a project of artist lab okay so um, in the last session i hope you remember we have done something from this frozen project right so let me show that uh, so we, we use this interface where we could actually create the frozen project, right? So I hope you remember in the last session, we have discussed that, uh, discussed about this creating a snowflake or, of type, right? Uh, we have been checking all these things and I told you I will be creating this line thing, which is very easy and I'll, I'll definitely create that one for you, right? I, I told you this, correct? So I'll just run this for you so that you can absolutely understand whatever I'm speaking about. I'll just run this. So you can see this pattern here, right? Do that shall be creating one like this. Okay. And yeah, I'm back with that with your video today. And I'm I'm just creating this same kind of a pattern. Okay. On artist lab. Okay. So let's go here and uh, let's check that out. So this is artist lab interface where uh, yeah. Okay. I'm oh, I, I, I've clicked on start over and uh, yeah, that's what happened. Okay. No worries. So yeah, this is artist lab interface. Okay. You can see this here. So this is actually Bob, right? Who shall be drawing my uh, things, whatever I want him to draw today. Okay. And we shall be creating this same kind of a pattern. Okay. So why am I not creating this on frozen? Like you can see, uh, this is how boring it is, right? Uh, we only have pastel colors here. And yeah, so let's let's get some more interesting colors on this artist lab, right? We have uh, we have bright colors here and we have multiple colors here. Uh, on Frozen, what happens is you only have these few pastel colors here. I'll show you if I can show them. Mm, yeah. So let's click on this. So you can see only we have these few colors here, right? Very light colors. And um, among these colors only it has to choose and it has to draw this, right? Uh, so that's why I don't want to do it on Frozen. And I wanted to do it on this artist lab. Okay. Yeah, let's get started. I'm so excited for this. Let's click on this. So um, I'm just getting this set width block from brushes okay set width will set the width of your pen basically okay uh, i just want one uh, because um, however it shall be creating multiple strokes right so it it shall never never feel like one uh, the thickness of the line is one now okay and then so you can observe here that the pattern is forming a circle right in a sense, it is forming a circle basically while drawing the lines, correct? That means uh, we already know circle has 360 degrees, right? So this uh, this is called as a complete angle, no? 360 degrees, correct? So that's why what 
what I am using is I'm going to loops. I'll just use this repeat loop. Okay. So what I will do, I'll just write 360 here. Why? Because uh, 360 times if it is repeating the same thing, it shall definitely form a circle. Correct. And that too, it shall definitely form a circle of lines if I'm writing the same kind of a code inside this. Okay. That's how I got the idea. Now let's go to actions. What it has to do first, it has to move forward, right? It to, to draw a line. So I'll just take this. Uh, I'll just say move forward by, uh, let's suppose I'm just drawing a 100 pixel line or, or let's create a 150 pixel line, okay? You can see that it is actually moving continuously, right? That's because it is repeating itself 360 times, okay? Uh, now I shall be doing the next thing. It not only has to move forward, but also it has to move backward uh, because it has to go back to its normal position to draw next line. Okay. So that's why what I'm doing, I'm going to actions. I'm just getting the same block again. Instead of forward, let's choose backward. Okay. And instead of this question symbols, we have to write same 150. Now you can see on the same position, it is actually repeating to do the same thing 360 times. Okay. But we don't want it to do the same thing repeatedly on the same place. Instead, it has actually, uh, it need to turn something like uh, at some angle, it has to turn and draw another line. Again, it has to turn some angle and then draw a line. So what I will do, I want this to be repeated 360 times. Definitely, I shall be turning one degree only, right? Because I want 360 strokes to be coming. So I'll write turn right. You can give turn left also, no problem turned uh, right by one degree only okay so i'm just writing one degree you can see something over here right something happening over here so this is um, drawing those all strokes basically okay don't worry about this i'm gonna make it more colorful now how let's go to brushes let's take set color random color wow wow <laughs> You can see this, right? I'll just run this for you. See, uh, I'll just slow this. You can see it's coming forward, going backward, turning one degree. Coming forward, going backward, turning one degree. Okay, so the same it is repeating 360 times let's let's now increase the speed wow this is this is like a visual treat right <laughs> i completely am enjoying this one <laughs> wow cool See, I told you this, this is going to be something really easy and very cool. This looks like a lollipop, right? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. So we have, we have been doing the same thing which our frozen uh, snowflake type line was doing. Can you see this? Can you see this? Both are same, <laughs> right? Okay, so yeah, this is how it is. And I hope you understood what exactly I was doing here, right? Like I told you, it was very simple and it actually is simple, correct? I hope you enjoyed this video and I, I definitely have, have enjoyed this because I kept, kept up my promise, right? And I came back with the same video which, uh, which I was promising you about correct <laughs> okay so yes this was all about our today's session and i'll be meeting you in the next series sorry next session uh maybe with a pattern video or programming concept video uh yeah you have to wait for it okay all right guys so uh you know what you have to do until then until my next video correct so you have to keep watching folks up okay do watch all my playlists right uh, watch them again and again if you want to, right? If you um, feel necessary, okay? So please do slow the videos up if you are feeling like they are very fast, okay? So you can slow them. Uh, I've shown how to slow the video 
uh, also in one of my videos okay so do check out that and uh, and so yeah if you all guys like my videos then please do like comment share and subscribe to my channel folks hub and if you have been trying to create interesting patterns like these you can absolutely share them with me okay i will be very happy to check all of them out and give you feedbacks on how to improve them or i will learn something new from your patterns where where you have ex you have been exploring right so yeah i shall be very happy please do uh, submit your links on the comment section below okay so what you have to do to submit the link you just have to click on share click on copy link to project and submit the link there paste the link there okay so this is all you have to do guys and i will be checking all of them out and i will be personally replying you back again right so yeah this is all for today okay bye bye guys and have a great day thank you so much for watching